You know, I, th I really love the putting it in context. It's not only Fairfield, but it's putting Fairfield in context to all of Iowa and the whole world. So I think that the context of this whole thing was really exciting tonight. I brought tears to my eyes and warmth to my heart and a dance to my step. It was great, and I look forward to the next seven. What a great piece of filmmaking. Just completely inspiring. I, I just feel expanded having watched it. Oh, God, it was so fantastic. I just loved it. This is National Geographic quality. I hope it just goes viral. It was great. Oh, my God, it was so great. He, he hit it out of the park. Just home run, absolutely. I love the deer scene. <laughs> I loved it. I loved it. And I was very impressed with the angle in which it started. In other words, this first film is a wonderful unifier for all the areas uh, of information and history and people's ways of life uh, to come together and make this place. This was a really fascinating movie. It was so well done, um, intricate, beautiful, interesting. I'm just so thrilled that I got to find out what Fairfield was like before I was here. There was just finesse in every aspect of the film. I, I have seen many documentaries, but a documentary about ancient history is usually a real bore. This was just, a, it was this edge of the seat, very interesting, beautiful, and artistically done in every respect. What struck me the most is that it covered so many dimensions. It covered from the scientific to the spiritual and gave you a clear sense on all those dimensions. You know, it had, it had authoritative archaeologists speaking about what is known and what is recorded. And it had the Native American historians talking about the, the inner feeling and being that is experienced uh, by their peoples associated with this land. And so it was, it was truly a broadening experience. I loved it. This film is fantastic. Dick has done an excellent job and all the people who helped him. We thank you so much, Dick, for producing this film.